One of the best ways I've found of getting backlinks to your site is to have a look at your competitors' websites in your niche and see who's backlinking to them, find out where they're getting their backlinks from. So let's just take an example and I'm going to type in internet marketing. Let's pick a, a competitor of mine and see. Um, okay, here we have one. Free internet marketing courses. So let me just copy the URL from that. Let's open up SEO Spyglass. I'm going to type in the URL, competitor's URL. Click on next and SEO Spyglass will now go away and look for the backlinks to this website. You can see the backlink count here and the number keeps rising. Okay, now um, SEO Spyglass has finished finding the links. It now says, would you like to update the project for backlink factors? And basically when I click the yes button, what's gonna happen is it, this software will then go away and it will check um, the page rank and whether the links are active and so on. Let me just pause the video. We'll be back as soon as it's finished. Okay, SEO Spyglass is now finished and for each backlink we have the search engine the backlink was found in, the title of that page, um, whether the backlink is still there, whether it links back. You see also it highlights the no follow tags, there's a missing link, page not found and so on. And anchor text, internet marketing course, internet marketing courses, internet marketing courses, and the anchor text of the links and the page rank of the page where that link occurs and this is where you can start looking well if we order by page rank you can have a look and see well you know some of these might be worth going to to see whether you can get links back chances are um, the the owner of this free internet marketing courses website probably has something like an affiliate program or um, it may even own some of these other websites but nonetheless there's the page rank of the pages where the links are appearing, the number of external links on the page where the link is, the total number of links on the page, um, a, a link value, this is unique to SEO Spyglass, it tells you how valuable the link is, so um, this link for example has a value of 1.7, that's the most valuable link according to SEO Spyglass. And the reason it's only a page rank two, but it's the only external link on the page. So the full page rank two is going to that particular uh, link. The domain where the link occurs, the IP address where the link is, the page rank of the domain where the link appears, whether or not that domain is in DMOS or Yahoo, the Alexa rank and the domain age. So we've got scads and scads of information here about all of the links and we have hundreds of them for this particular domain. How can this help us? Well, there's various things we can do. We can go and have a look at the domains that are linking to this site and request a link, or there's some built-in filters here. So for example, we can have a look at the links from link directories. So here are the link directories. And let's go down to where the page page rank is. Here's the link directories where this site is listed. Those are the page ranks of the pages. So let's have a look at this first one then. Okay, and here's that page that's now loaded up. If I just scroll this down a little bit, you can see that this particular page has a page rank of four. And it's a links page. And if we scroll all the way down here, you can see here we have a link internet marketing courses and if you look at the status bar at the bottom of the browser in this area down here you can see that's the link to the website if I just check um, using this toolbar here which toggles no follow all of these links are do follow so there's a good place to request a link back to your site and you'll see at the very top they have um, some useful links. They've got various categories here. And then you can go and check out some of these other ones here. This business.com directory is a no follow. Um, it's easy to spot, so it's easy to um, ignore it if that's the sort of thing you want to, if you want to ignore no follow links. But you can quickly see which of these links are linking back. You can see the page rank of the pages 
and then you can approach those pages as well. Those are the links from link directories, but you can also have a look at backlinks from blogs and forums, and these are the blogs and forums that are linking to this particular site. So this software has found over 300 links from blogs and forums. Many of them are yes, do follow links. And if we have a look at the page, page rank, let's just order it by that. You can see some of these, page rank three, down to page rank one, all of those would be worth having a look to see whether you can get links from those particular sites. You just go to the particular site in question, have a look and see whether um, you can get a link back from there. You can also do other searches as well. In fact, you can define some searches yourself. But this one here, show backlinks from home pages only. This is what the home pages that are linking to this particular site. And there's 272 home page links. There's a good chance that the, the same guy owns some of these websites as well. Or as I said, it maybe he has affiliate programs um, and that's how he's getting these links. But you can easily check any of these. Let's have a look at some of the higher page rank ones. Scroll to the top. Here's a, a page rank five home page link. It's also possible that some of these are text links that have been bought. So you need to have a look and see what the site is, who there is to contact, and there's the link there. Look down to internet marketing courses. Cody Moyers free internet marketing courses, right? So I know whose website this is now. And you can see down here in the status bar that Indeed, that's an affiliate banner, and that is one of the ways in which he's getting a lot of these backlinks. So if you have your own products, then that's a really good way of getting backlinks from some of these other sites. And one of the nice things about this software is you can highlight groups of these links. These are the ones from the home pages only, and we can do an analysis of them to have a look and see a number of different factors and you can see here, this is the keywords tab. Down here it tells you what that is. It's the keyword column, shows all the keywords found within the titles and anchor, anchor texts of the links pointing to your competitor's URL. So these are the, the words that make up the links pointing to his site. Marketing, internet, courses, free. And then you've got anchor text, shows you the percentages, the anchor URL page, um, rank of the inbound links. You can see the majority of them are page rank zero or page rank nothing. Then there's page rank ones, twos, threes, fours, and one page rank five. So it shows you the spread. And also it gives you all these other details, domain page rank, IP address, um, country, whether they're in DMOS or not. And you can see that 99% um, of those inbound links to his site are not in DMOS. Only two of the links are, and whether they're in Yahoo, um, and so on. So there's massive amounts of useful information in here, especially if you're looking to try and build links into your website. And just quickly to, to finish off, if we have a look at these keywords here, you can see the top three words are marketing, internet courses, and then the fourth one is free. So just to show you the power of the backlinks, I would expect this site to rank really well for internet marketing courses, but also because the domain name is free internet marketing courses, I would expect it probably to be number one in Google for free internet marketing courses. We can have a quick check. Um, we'll do the free internet marketing courses first. And there you go. Their site, that site is number one. If we get rid of the free bit at the beginning, I would still expect it to rank quite well. These, up, these top three here are sponsored links. So number one in Google, free internet marketing courses again. So that shows you the power of the backlinks and the link text within the backlinks as well. Plus also don't forget a massive boost for this site is that it actually has the phrase in the domain name itself. And of course, if you just looked at the anchor text, you can see the most popular anchor text here with 34% of inbound links is internet marketing and 20% is internet marketing courses. So for the term internet marketing, we would also expect this site to do really well. And as you can see here in Google, from 164 million results, this site is number three. So there's the power of backlinks. There's a good way to go and find them.